Well, 84 people with a variety of backgrounds are the first graduating cohort here at the Christine E. Lynn College of Nursing at FAU. Now, this program is a six semester track which requires a bachelor's degree or higher to enroll. They're very dedicated and um, they're successful at it. So I don't think it matters what degree you come in. Florida Atlantic University leaders say their first round of graduates from the part-time nursing program are ready to tackle any challenge and are now qualified for any entry-level nursing position in the country. They say this is the only program of its kind in the state, allowing qualifying students to take classes on nights and weekends, earning their nursing degree in a couple years. I think it's important because we want people to continue working and continue contributing to the workforce um, while still pursuing their educational dream of becoming nurses. So. Yeah, good job. The Florida Hospital Association says more than 75% of hospitals in the state are facing a critical staffing shortage, which is why FAU leaders say this program is more important now than ever. So we knew that even before the pandemic, there was a national nursing shortage. And even now with the pandemic, we've seen that shortage accelerate. And so we definitely need additional people to join the nursing workforce. This program has about 400 students at any given time. And like any nursing program, it entails a lot of hard work. I think it's, it's a very busy program, but I think nursing is such a rewarding career and the students find that. And tonight on our website, WPBF.com, we'll post more information about this program. Reporting live from FAU in Boca Raton, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.